One of the scariest things for new programmers is error messages. They're bright red, they're often quite complex, they contain a lot of information, and they can be really off-putting, even for experienced programmers. But learning to read error messages is a really useful skill. It will help you write better codes, it will help you debug your codes, and it will help you understand what's going on when an error occurs. So we have seen error messages in, pre in previous notebooks, and the first one that we're going to talk about in this notebook is the same as we've seen before. So I'm I've defined a variable here, and it's a string, and then I'm going to try and run the round function on this string. Now, already, this doesn't make sense. You can't round a string, and Python knows that. And it gives us this type error, and it says type string, my variable, doesn't define the round method. So round doesn't exist for strings. This all makes sense. You'll also notice that in the traceback, there's a bright green arrow pointing to the offending line. So when you get a type error, if you can follow this thing, which is called a traceback, you can work out what line the error is on, and then underneath you can work out what the error itself is. Create a new markdown cell and describe this in a way that you understand for future reference.